Welcome back, everybody. I am here with my new best bud in Tonner Dolls. I am here with Ryan, and we are going to give you a sneak peek at the wonderful American models, which are these gorgeous 22-inch dolls by Robert Tonner. And Ryan works with incredible people all over the globe that sew for him and realize his what he his vision what he wants in fashion so ryan let's start at the beginning right here so my very first um american model was garden walk over here um, it was a new sculpt for robert at the time and um when i saw her i just died um, the face sculpt is so beautiful um i love the the pattern on the dress the style of the dress the era um, and I originally thought that she would be just a one of, you know, um, cause I was, you, you were just going to stop here just at this one. I was 16 inch all the way <laughs> and she would be like nicely displayed in a corner somewhere. Um, and then as I got to looking at his website and other things, um, I saw, you know, this is a Tonner fashion that was just the fashion. And I was like, well, that would go with the blue one, same period, so I should buy that. <laughs> and I did. Um, it was had a white wig, which I'm not a big wig fan, so I had a basic Mary, which was the next version of the, the Mary sculpt that it came out with, styled to work with that. And then there's this very talented artist on um, called Kellen, Karen Miller Castro, who does these beautiful fans. They're all one-of-a-kind fans. And I saw that and I thought, well, now I definitely have to have the outfit because I want the fan. Oh, I love the fan. Um, so I have several fans from her for different different dolls. Now, and then who is this? So again, that's the basic Mary. The fashion is from uh, a convention in 2013. It was the great eras of fashion. So it was like an Edwardian kind of tea party. Um, and I found the fashion on eBay, um, not the doll. So it, it lucked out. I thought that was beautiful. So I, I bought that. And he did a series of five dolls for that event um, in different colors. So it just led me deeper to ruin. It led him deeper to ruin. So what you're seeing, everybody, are the incredible dolls. We have gone room by room for the Christmas pageant. You're going to love our programs. But we're giving you a, just a little sneak peek so you can see these amazing there's and it's nothing like seeing it in person but we're trying to get it as best we can now what i love about this one right here ryan is the jewelry can you tell us about the jewelry well i worked um in fine jewelry at saks fifth avenue for 30 years um and there's you would get things um from vendors as incentive gifts or you'd find things at a flea market um so the jewelry on this particular doll here is all real it's so, all real. White gold, diamond <laughs> sapphire earrings, <laughs> pearls, diamond sapphire in the choker. And this was also another earring that I had, but it was only one. Um, so I had the post sharpened and bent to make like a little hook so that it stuck into the, the bodice. Um, Gorgeous. Uh, so there's several dolls that have real jewelry. <laughs> I love the real jewelry. Is this a real... Dime. It's a real locket. Yes, it's a real locket, of course. This is absolutely amazing. If you are out there and you are tuning in with us, please let us know and share the video. You, th this at the Christmas pageant, you're going to see so much footage just of the historical fashions of modern, of television, so many homemade not homemade, but uh, couture pieces that have been made in people's homes across the globe. Special for Ryan. He does such an incredible job working with these designers who make these gowns for him. Your body of work is just, it's just everything. Thank you so much for sharing with us, Ryan. I am going to sign off because we have to go to lunch. We have been doing dolls for hours and hours and hours, and it has been such a wonderful day. We filmed a bunch of footage for you for the convention, and the Christmas pageant. I'm just going to end so you. We're just in one of the rooms. But Ryan is, he knows his, his stuff. 
So you're you're just gonna love it. Thank you so much, Ryan. You're welcome. Oh, we're we're having fun. All the all the doll people out there are just going crazy. Marcy just said, please tell, please tell my Ryan, how do we keep these lovely so clean? Well, you have a very, very clean house. And when you dust, it just And I use a soft artist brush. Okay. With really, really thin, you know, soft bristles and just lightly brush them. Okay. Oh, you know, like, like yeah. just brush them down and just and get the dust off because you, mm. you do have to dust them no matter how clean you keep your house dust happens no matter what so yes okay all right everybody share the video we're out here in in california doing doll stuff thank you so much ryan bye everybody bye